Mr. President, you addressed the nation a while ago. We address you on behalf of the nation. Your government, your presidency has become an absurdity. You have laid the foundation, paved the way to destroy our lives, our present life, and as well as the future, the lives of all Sri Lankans. Your conscience knows how you came to power, and your henchmen very well know what they did to get you into power. Therefore, dear President, your government, your family, and you have bluntly let us down. If you are not able to run this country democratically, you always say that you are a democratic leader, show that your behavior, their action and attitude matches what you preach. If you can't run this country, let the people to choose a government of their choice. Not only you, Mr. President, everybody who is sitting at parliament consuming public funds are responsible for this agony. We as citizens are well aware that we ought to play our part. Here we are all obviously frustrated uh, when there are educated, knowledgeable people. It's quite unfortunate that we have fools, uh, morons who are running this country. Uh, people who are taking key decisions, unfortunately, are absolutely no brains. These guys forget being in the parliament. I don't think they are good enough to be serving uh, in a coffee shop. So uh, we have a governor in the central bank who has a capacity of a kid uh, of over five years uh, and he's, uh, he's actually taking uh, a lot of key decisions that is impacting the country. It is very unfortunate and we also have, today we have a uh, so-called the finance minister is actually talking to the, the president of India uh, and, and of course the, the the finance team in India. Yeah, I am not so sure what, what he's going to discuss. We should have first discussed all what he's going to discuss here with the Sri Lankan people and told them exactly what he's going to discuss, but unfortunately that hasn't, that hasn't happened. So we as a country, unfortunately, now going through a very difficult time. We want the, uh, uh, the, the, the so-called the terrorists. I, I brand them as terrorists, the Rajapaksas as terrorists, and these guys should be put in jail not running a country. I think we are all here as a, uh, a group to show that we are against what is happening in the country and I would encourage or uh, ask the rest of the people in this country to come out to the state side and that we join the, the, the people who are here.